Man, red is definitely the best paint of all. Blue? White? Where's red? Hello everybody, I'm Love from Machines, and today we are reviewing James. Or the most specific adventures, James. So, I guess we can get started. Right now. As soon as the camera cuts. C cut, camera, cut, cut. Alright, so let's look at the model. Uh, thanks to the magic of editing, I actually don't have to uncouple it myself. It already is uncoupled. Thanks, editing. Anyway, so, here we go. And now the buffers aren't actually painted like that when you first buy it. They're actually red. But I actually painted that with uh, a Sharpie marker, which was pretty cool, I guess. There's no buffers on the back. So, now, this model is very nice. I do enjoy all the paint on it, especially that gold paint and just glosses in the light. The one problem I have is that in the original take along, this thing is actually cut in so that you can, you know, there's a detail inside the cab, but now there isn't, so, mm, that's bad, but, eh, it's not too bad. And, uh, if we're looking closely, oh, looks how much paint that looks. The gold paint really makes it. And they actually painted in, uh, I keep forgetting what this thing's called, but it's like a, a rod right here. An iron rod, I think. And there's this, uh, gold dome. But he, he doesn't have any painted whistles, which is sad. Because I know the wooden railway one did. Now, another thing I want to talk about is the wheel configuration. You see the three wheels here, and then all you see is a painted in fourth wheel. <sighs> but the weird thing is that for the Adventures Mattel, they're actually going to have the correct wheel configuration, which is odd. Same on the other side. And the couplings can spin 360 degrees. So that you can couple it th th this way or this way. You basically can couple in any direction you want, except this way or this way or this way or this way. You can only you couple both ways is what I'm trying to say. Unlike the modern take and play, which in fact here I have an example of right now. So here is take and play Percy and take and play Philip. Now, if you do like this, they couple, but if I say do it this way, they don't couple, and if I do it this way, they don't couple. However, with James over here, if I do it this way, he couples. If I do it this way, he couples. If I go like this, Rotate that. He couples. And if I go like this, he also couples. So in any direction, they can couple, except for the modern pick and play. Now let's take a look at the tender. Bam! There it is. So, the tender actually looks quite nice. And there it is, James. It doesn't say tender, but it does say James. There's the number five right there, and that's on both sides. There's the cool, there's the curve, there's the couplings, and once again, the buffers were not painted when you first get it. These were actually painted by me using a Sharpie marker. Just be very careful when you're using a Sharpie marker if you do plan to do that, because you ruined your model if you do. Uh... Yeah, looks quite nice. I mean, there's not much to talk about. It's literally like a square on wheels. So it does roll. It does roll. That's, that's, that's good. That's good. And uh, it, it it connects with James, which is accurate. Uh, but yeah, I guess that's just about the tender. So uh. Let's move on to the face. Now the face looks actually very cool. I do enjoy the face a lot. It looks very good. And that's about it for the face. It, it just looks good. 
Very good. So let's do some comparisons. Here's James with Steven. They're showing you a 360 of the engine, you can get an idea of what they actually look like. And there. So there's Hugh, Hugo. So there's Steven, Hugo. So there's Hugo, and finally, here's Hurricane. And there's Hurricane. Now, time for my overall opinion on this. Well, he is nice. And I don't think he has that many flaws at all. I think he looks quite nice and sparkly and glossy. The only minor nitpicks I would have is that the cab isn't cut in. And their buffers aren't painted in. And I would have liked if there was a white running board, but... This is actually pretty good compared to all the other hurri uh, hurricanes, all the other adventures. So I do actually quite like this model of James, and I do think it actually does look accurate to the show. And I mean, I, I don't think they can ever get the face wrong. The face just always looks like the person, or person, looks like the character inside the show, which is very nice. So, I guess I'll give this a, uh, I don't know a 8 out of 10 on my rating scale and uh you know I'm feeling generous I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 cause those were really just minor nitpicks I mean painting buffers I can just use a sharp marker for that the cutting cab it still looks nice with the black right there and the uh, white running board yeah that might have been too hard because there's these little bumps here i forgot what they're called but yeah it's not really that bad it's just minor details so yeah nine out of ten well anyway i'm low for machine that looks to laugh out loud i love the number four and i love machine goodbye all right i guess i'll see you in the next time it's or taking playtime as adventures whichever one comes first well see ya